guys, Dottie here. Today we're unboxing Mini Brand Series 3. We got five to open up, so let's take a look at that collector's guide. So before we look at our collector's guide, we got two things to cover first. Number one, as you can see, I only have five balls. I went to Target today and all they had was five, so forgive me. Next time I promise I'll open up six. And number two, my poor little hand. Let me tell you what happened. So I really love mayonnaise. And I ran out of mayonnaise and I bought a big old jar. And when I unscrewed the plastic cap, it had that paper on top. And I couldn't get the top to peel off. So I got a knife and I stuck the knife into the paper and I brought it out way too fast. And with that, it cut my hand. And yes, it really hurt. So thank goodness it doesn't need any stitches, but it was a real deep cut. So it'll be a little while before it gets healed, but I'll be wearing band-aids until then so you don't have to look at the scar. However, from now on, I'm gonna have my roommate open up the mayonnaise. So back to our regularly scheduled program. So if this is your first time watching a mini brand video, hi, welcome, you have definitely come to the right place. If this is your first time looking at the collector's guide, let's take a quick look for you. Here are our golds. We got Hershey's chocolate syrup, strawberry syrup, icebreakers, Icy, Love Hearts, and Holy Guacamole. And here is our glow in the dark. All right, you guys, I am filming at night, so we can definitely see if we got any glow in the dark pieces. We got Flavor Ice, Mike and Ike's, Royal Pudding, Sweet Hearts, and Almond Breeze. We have not found any metallic pieces yet, so we're definitely on the hunt today for that. We got Hershey's Syrup, Wheat Thins, Apple Pie Spice, Royal Pudding, Hershey's Cookies and Cream, and Crystal Light. So next, I'm going to go ahead and just hold these commons up. You are more than welcome to pause if you want to see anything a lot closer. And I think we can all agree on that we are not a fan that some of the Series 2 pieces are in the Series 3 collection. Now, I do hope that one day there is going to be a mini brand Series 4, and I do hope mini brand Series 3 pieces are not included in that. Here's our Dose & Co. We got bags, carts, and baskets. Uh, the display that never works. <laughs> and that's everything. All right, you guys, let's chatter. More opening. Let's do this. Number one. That cork looks a little dirty, or is it just me? All right, here we go. Here is number one. Let's see if we can get some metallics and some gold and some of those glow in the dark. And our number one piece, oh, it's Dose & Co. Now, Dose & Co was in Mini Brands Series 2. So if you're like me, you have quite a few of these. All right, here is Orange Slice number two. Ooh, I don't have many of these. We have the Weiler's Light Lemonade. I don't think I've ever seen this in my local grocery store. I do live in Los Angeles, so I don't think I've ever seen this. Do they sell this where you live? Let me know down in the comments. Hey, come on, gold. No, oh no, it's the Velveeta. The only reason why I say oh no, because this is another piece from series two. Oh no. Oh no, this is also from series two. <laughs> Wait, is this from series two or from series three? I can't remember. Can you all please let me know down in the comments? I can't remember now that I'm thinking about it. Let me know down in the comments. Last slice from ball number one. We have our handy dandy collector's guide. And in our collector's guide, we got <gasps> the TGI Friday poppers. I think this is new to my collection. Yay! It is the Poppers Cheddar Cheese Stuffed Jalapenos. Mmm, I don't know about you, but I love jalapenos. Happy to have a new piece. Number two. So this is something I want to ask all of my viewers, or heck, if you are new, you are more than welcome to answer this question too. I have really gotten into slime lately. <laughs> I know I'm a little late to the trend, but I think it's so much fun. Would you all be interested in seeing a slime video? Of course, I'm going to keep doing my mini brands, but I would like to know if you all would like to see me do some slime videos. If you would like that, please, please, please let me know down in the comments. It's very, very important. Okay, so let's go with slice number one, and we have the Jello. Oh, we are getting so many series two pieces. The Jello vanilla pudding, as I just said, it is from series two. And we have, oh my goodness, this is also from series two. Did I get a bad batch or something? All right, let's see if we'll have some better luck with this one. And we have Baker's Chocolate, which is also from series two. Oh my goodness. 
Okay, let's see if we can get a series three piece with this slice right here, okay? Look, there we go. Okay, all right, all right. So this is definitely from series three. We got our icebreaker sour, my favorite type of icebreakers. And I love that it's kind of pink and purplish, so cute. Here is our last slice. Hopefully it's a series three piece. And this is cool. Okay, this is definitely series three. Series two was the cool whip light. So it's nice to see a series three piece. Number three. So if this is your first time watching one of my videos, hi, how are you? I'm so glad you clicked on my video. If you're a returning subscriber or viewer, it's so good to see you again. Let me introduce myself to you. My name is Dottie and I'm a toy collector. And I don't know what that is, but it looks kind of gross. And we open up so much fun stuff on this channel. Lots and lots of mini brands, anything else I think you would like. If you'd like to come on this crazy unboxing journey with us, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that notification bell okay we need some golds we need some metallics and we need some glow in the darks oh i thought this was going to be a metallic but unfortunately it's not we just found the hershey syrup and here is our collector's guide and we have it looks like we have more tgi fridays we have our first repeat is the tgi fridays poppers and i'll go ahead and just put them together do you all see how disorganized I am today? What is up with me? That's much better, right? And this one was already kind of open. It looks like we have a little basket. Let me show you what that looks like all put together. So forgive me, you all. I think I'm not going to put this together because my hand still really hurts. So I'm going to go ahead and just not put this together today. But I'm sure you all know what the carts and baskets look like. All right, so let's open up the gross one. <laughs> and we have Mr. Good Bar. Yay! So we got a series three piece. So we have Mr. Good Bar, and I always point this out. It definitely says giant. Last slice, and we have another series two piece Philadelphia cream cheese. Number four. Ah! <laughs> Here is number one. This one was partially open and we have another Dosinko. Again, Dosinko is from series two. And we'll put them together. Come on, series three. And we got another repeat. We got the Weiler's Light. And we have another, <laughs> we have another Kool-Aid. My God, you guys, what if this whole ball is just a repeat? Oh no, we didn't get a repeat, yay! We got the love hearts. And it looks like we got the little scale. Let me show you what that looks like all put together. And here's our little scale all put together. Number five, last ball. All right, this is our last chance to get some golds and metallics. And ooh, what's this? We have Hershey's Special Dark, yay! This is definitely a part of Series 3, and I like that it also says Giant. And we got another repeat. We got another Icebreaker Sour. We'll put them together. Oh, no! Another Velveeta! Oh, no! And we have, this is also from series two. We got the Rascal and Friends. And lastly, we got some grocery bags. This is everything we got from today's unboxing. And I have to say this unboxing was pretty disappointing. Mostly because we got so many series two pieces like the Dose and Co, the Cream Cheese, the Kool-Aid Jammers, the Jello, the Velveeta, the Craft Singles, the Rascal and Friends, and even the Baker's Chocolate. So I'm really, really hoping that our next unboxing will get some more Series 3 pieces. So make sure you stay tuned for that unboxing. All right, you guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I do tons of unboxings on my channel. If that's something you're interested in, please hit that subscribe button and that <coughs> notification bell. All right, you guys, happy hunting, happy unboxing, and have a great Kool-Aid day. Bye-bye. <laughs>